Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. On this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how you can create this night sky moon using Blender software. So first, I'm gonna add a UV sphere, scale it up, click shade mode, then go to the tab modifier and add a subdivision surface. Change the value to 2. After that, go to the shading tab and create a new material we're gonna start by adding a masquerade texture then click ctrl t to use the mode ringer ok, add a color around and a bomb node plug them together just like that Increase the details and decrease the dimension. After that, we use the color ramp. Then add a mix RGB. Increase the white value and change the color to the bluish color. Okay, now just decrease the scale of the masquerade texture. Then change the dimension to 0 0.1. Good. Now we have our moon. I'm gonna change the color to the more white color. And let's render it. Here we have our moon. The next step is gonna be adding the light effect of the moon. To do that, we're gonna need emission shader and a mix shader. Plug the mix shader here, then add the emission shader. Plug the color of the mix RGB into the emission color, then decrease the factor of the mix shader into 0 0.3. And now we have something that looks like a on the On the bloom, increase the intensity, the radius, and the threshold, change it to 0 0.6. Okay, next go to the world settings, add noise texture, add a color ramp, and an emission. Plug the emission into the surface, and the color into the color, and the factor into the factor. Increase the details and change the scale to 200. Now play with the color of the color ramp until we get our night sky. Okay, I think I'm gonna leave it just like that. Increase the strength to 15. Here we have our star skies. Let's jump to the clouds. To create the clouds effect, we're gonna use the same method that we used for the moon. First, add a cube. Need a top. It on the Z axis. Then create a new material. Add a mask grave texture. And also use the non line grab. After that, delete the principal VSDF. Add a principal volume. Lock the volume on the volume. Add a color ramp. And plug it into the color of the principal volume. Increase the details and change absorption color to the white color. Now, we with the color ramp, change the black color to the middle and also change the white color. After that, go to the render tab and search for the matrix. Change the file size to lower value. Now, let's decrease the scale. Also the dimension. I'm gonna change it to 0 0.6. Here we have our clouds. You can also play with the color around here. To increase the density of the clouds. To animate the clouds, just go to the mapping nodes and on the X location. You can see that if we change the value, the clouds are moving. So, to do that, just select the x-axis, 
select the X location, just type in hashtag nine dash five hundred. Here we can see all the notes in pink. If you want to change the speed, just change the value of the frame. So that's it for today's video. If you liked my tutorial, please watch the other videos tutorial and let me know what you think in the comment section. Thank you.